<laughs> Welcome I'm back to Room Milwaukee. dancing, baby. We were just jamming off of the uh, commercial Five, break. six, wake up. That's, That's right. right. Chef Fecker is here with us in the kitchen. What are you doing? I thought pasta salad. Why are we... Why are we doing what we're doing? Yeah, Brian, that stuff up? That's a great, that's a What's great that question. About? First of all, pasta salad is all uh, dependent on the regions where it comes from. That's why the ingredients within a pasta salad, especially in Italy, is different. We have Mediterranean, we have Greek, we have all of those things. Now you had, How do you, you know all of them? My pasta I, salad, if I do, it comes from my kitchen. I, I know, it's supposed to. It's supposed to because we're supposed to make <laughs> it in the kitchen. Right. What they have kitchens in Italy. Right, yeah. I keep okay. looking in there to see why there's no Can macaroni or anything uh, in there. That, what is again, it? that's something that you well, ask also. Ask, yes, can, can I you yeah. use any kind of pasta? For Absolutely. Pasta Even yeah. like noodles, like spaghetti Absolutely. Noodles? But then you have to make sure that your ingredients are cut in longer strands oh, okay. so they grab the noodle. Okay. Now we are dicing everything. Why? Because we're using penne and it has a hole in it. So we want mm. these flavors to go in there. We have different pastas for different reasons. And pasta salads are usually created with your leftovers. So imagine you have these beautiful short ribs that have been cooked the night before. Okay. The next day you take them, you shred them, you take the juices from the short ribs, mix them with a little bit of mayonnaise. Why don't we do that? Why don't you start the... Uh, I can do that. You ready? Right. Go, go ahead with two teaspoons of mayonnaise. Okay. Mm -hmm. Rob, how many do we, uh, days do we have to uh, spring? Oh, we're less than eight until the actual equinox. So this occurs. does make yeah. sense. We yeah. have a beautiful okay. vegetable. Then the, all of that roasted garlic. <laughs> well, that's going to have a good punch. Yes. Ooh. All right. It smells fabulous. And you've already pre diced what, the carrots and the celery? Exactly. There? They're going to go in here with the onions that are oh, being you're caramelized. Fry them up too. Okay. Yes. Why am I doing this? Is because I'm creating an extra flavor profile, layer of flavor by caramelizing, evaporating the water content naturally intensifying the sugar contest. So is now, this going to be a cold pasta salad? Yes, it is. Okay. Yes, it is. That's a great question as well because what we do here, we have the tendency of cooking the pasta, letting it get cold, have the ingredients cold, combine them. There's no marriage of flavor because the pores of the pasta is not open when it's cold. Oh. We got to make sure that the pasta is warm when we toss oh, it with the dressing. Oh. Sucks in all that I dressing. I a lot of folks make that mistake with you know? it. They do, so. they do. But because oh. why? They don't listen to Fekker. <laughs> listen to me, right, will stop, ya? Stop fussing with okay, people okay, and tell okay, me okay, how to okay, make okay, this. Fine, okay, fine, fine. What am I doing? I've fine. got this. Uh, give me a drizzle of extra virgin olive oil in there. Go three turns. Your One, drizzle two, or my drizzle? Three. Your drizzle. Go Ooh. for it. All right. Okay, then white balsamic, which hasn't been aged in uh, chestnut barrels. How much of that? That's good. Okay. Three to one ratio, that's perfect. Okay. Now get your whisk and let's whisk it. Ready, Rob? Go whisk it, baby. <laughs> whisk it, baby. Whisk it, yeah, yeah. Okay. Now, with your wrist, not with your oh, full arm. Yeah, with your wrist. That's it. You see how fast and easy you can Dr. do that? Well, look at very, that. Very that's right. The bell peppers, also, we have to oh. dice. But as soon as you're done with the dressing, that's good. You can set that aside. Okay. Oh, you know what? Something else. Drizzle a little bit of that the sun dried tomato oil in there as well. do that. Hold your tomato oh, with your oil finger. Oil yeah. Okay. Beautiful, Not go for tomato, it. tomato, just the oil. That's it, the oh. tomato we're going to put in the pasta side. And yeah, then okay. yeah. hit it with the wrist again. That's right. Where do you find such good uh, bell peppers this time of year? The bell peppers are, you know, I get majority of my uh, vegetables from Maki, who's oh, okay. a local, uh, you know, vegetable purveyor. So, Would you what? dice some of this for me, darling? I can do that. Mm -hmm. You dice it the way you want it. Right. Just make sure you first cut it in strips. All right. Look at the way she holds that finger. You Very go, girl, good. that's beautiful. And it's such nice. good to have colorful food. Roll your here. knife. Oh. When you cut, let it go. That's it. Ah, you see, it cuts all the way through. That's true. Beautiful. Now turn it around okay. and dice it. Right. Okay, when this comes together, I'm going to toss this warm in that dressing. Take that pasta, strain it, and warm, put it in that dressing. Toss it, go in the refrigerator, okay. everything. So when we come back, we're going to create a beautiful medley of greens in the base. Okay. And then we're going to put our pasta salad on there. If you want to serve this as an entree, I suggest a protein with it. A breast of chicken, like chicken that can be cooked okay. in the same pan that you have all these yum yums right. of flavor. Or like you said before, leftovers. Is that's it. Right? Exactly. Yes, please. All you, of this? That's right. And More you know color what? The better. The, exactly, because you eat with your eyes first. So the yellow is going to pop, the red is going to be over. Okay, now you're going to see you're going to have more difficulty cutting that. You know why? Because why? you're cutting the skin. <gasps> that's why when you have it the other way around, it's much easier. Oh. The things you the know. Tricks he knows. Chef. It's, it's like he's a professional. Yeah. <laughs> it's like I'm doing this for a living. I know. Yeah. All right, so we'll come back and we'll get this whole thing finished Absolutely. before the show's Clearly done. Clearly I don't. What would you do if your social security number showed up online for the whole world to see? <gasps> Some pretty high profile names are dealing with that this morning. We'll talk about it coming up. You call after me. The break. <laughs> you call me. Well, you're just Chef. zero. It's yeah. really early on. Yeah, right. I got you. Fine. <laughs>